Playing a little golf. Today's coverage brought to you by EA Sports and the PGA Tour. Today it's live opening round coverage of the Career Builder Challenge. PGA West. I'm gonna tear this course up. Don't spill my soda. Seamus McShane. Now over to the sixth hole. Early in the round and playing reasonably well. Nothing great, but has certainly not given a whole lot away. Yeah, and actually a good, good position to really springboard the round from here. Quiet on the tee. I think this one looks like it might have a postage stamp on it. Airmail City. Yeah, lick it. Send it. Well, that was Ooh, almost like that's what he wanted to do, but why yeah. would you want it to run over the back? Second shot coming out of the rough here. That shot Ooh, right there from that lie in the rough to knock it that close. That's good. Settles in over the putt. That little ten footer. Oh, Just you're killing me, the edge, Frank. What yeah, the hell? At least he's burning the edges. You know you're hitting good parts. Even par currently. Well, with that drop shot, yeah, that's he needs to one over five. for the tournament. Frank, this is like a big water park here at PGA West. We saw it at the sixth, and here again at the seventh, a challenging par for 346 yards. I've never ever seen anyone try and drive this green, so it's just a layup. You see the bunker down there in the distance that really is the stop sign. So something that's short oh, no. of that, but really what I prefer is try and lay up on a nice number. Something that you've got a full right shot in, whether that be a 9-on or an 8-on or a wedge. You'd like to have a oh. full club in here. Frank, he is one of the longest hitters in the game, but at some point you have to hit a fairway. Yeah, he's uh, certainly not the straightest. I think that was the bit you're going to put in the middle. Good-looking shot right here. Frank, not close, but from that line, hey, not bad. That water. Oh, that's actually, oh, seriously, given the conditions, down. Rich. It's downhill seven inches. four-round tournament setting himself up for a good weekend maybe a great one the young star makes his birdie now the second par five on this opening nine here at pga west frank what are we looking at the bunker down the right side gives you that optical illusion because it sort of has that curvy edge to it plus it sort of moves its way to that right side and then you notice there's a bunker on the left that sneaks in on the left side so this isn't just sort of blazed away off the tee it still requires a good straight tee shot um, if you do air a little bit, then you've got to be very cognizant of the bunkers up on the left side as you get closer to the green. Oh, that's a good swing. Yeah, perfect. Coming from the right. 
Look now the approach chase. shot here on this par 5 8. An exceptional shot on the green and in position Davis for a birdie. Fired up. Yeah, it's a full melody now. Back to back birdies. We'll see. And with the birdie, moves into the top ten on the leaderboard. And moves into some very good company. Frank, as we arrive here at the par 4 ninth, 452 yards, I, I hear uh, players like you often say, I'm going to take it on. What do you mean by that, and how does it apply to this particular tee shot? Well, you, you have options, obviously. Uh, one is to hit it down that right side, which is your best shot. Uh, the easy way is obviously to bail it down, out down the left side, but then you, you're almost giving into the hole, like you're accepting you're going to make bogey if, you, you know, if you're lucky. So in the end, you're forced to go back to option A, which is actually to challenge the best shot you have, which is down the right side. Well, this one should be safely on deck here. What a nice hey, shot, right on the green and a pretty easy putt on the way. Getting set now over the putt. Boom! Three in a row. And yet another birdie, this time inching into the top five. Ian Poulter. Victor Dubuisson. Rich Lerner alongside Frank Nabilo for EA Sports. And we are back at PGA West, getting set to continue the action on the back nine. Beautiful hole here. Rock border that lines the water here at number 10. It's 416 yards. That's a good swing. Oh, I like that. Oh, this looks good. Certainly is. They'll be pretty happy with Position that. Position A. yard poke off the tee. Yeah. Now the second shot here at 10. That's a good swing. Appears to be a smart shot, Frank. Yeah, no problem here. That's going to fly all Oh, the way. yeah. That is classy. Not a chance of going in. Just a couple of feet. And with that birdie, moves to third place. Now at the long par 5 11. They call it eternity with good reason. It is 617 yards. Frank, what's the game yeah, plan here? Hit it as long long as you can. Uh, hopefully only a couple of times and you, you can get fairly close to this green. A little pitch up there. But uh, even if you go for this green or try and get close, that's when you start to notice the water that comes in on the left side. So you can't just bash away. Might only be a couple of bunkers in play off the tee, but they have to be avoided. Now the third shot here at the par 
another good swing, and it looks like, Frank, another really good shot. Early part of this second nine, a good approach shot. Now, pretty good chance for birdie. It's no snack, though. It's like kissing your mother-in-law. Nudge this one home, finish it up. That's a solid par. Still in it, Frank. So, one round in the books and a lot to chew on here. There is. This is going to be a tough championship to pull away. The standard of golf, especially that first page of the leaderboard. Excellent golf. We're getting better. Heath Slope. Those are all the people that voted for Donald Trump. I should withdraw with back problems. This is EA Sports, PGA Tour coverage coming your way. It's second round coverage of the Career Builder Challenge. Seamus McSeamus. 14th hole, par four of 389 oh, yards. Uh, it is short, but Frank, there is some danger lurking along the way. Yeah, most of it's sand. Uh, two options, really, poke it down that left side, let it run down there like a bowling alley. Either that or take that bunker completely out of play. 290, 300 yard cutter and get it down there where it's just a flick wedge and just a good solid tee shot right there, about 280 yards. Uh, we're in the white today. Oh, Frank, what do you like here on this approach shot at 14? Green is, is more triangular. It's wider at the front, narrows as you get towards the back of this green. If you're going to go with that back flag, you can perhaps bring something in there a little lower and sort of skip it up. Apart from that, just a nice high soft landing short iron. Outstanding oh, yeah. strike right there, right off the center of the club face, and a good chance for birdie. See if he can go one better than yesterday when he made par. This putt for birdie. Big Sheamus. So one shot closer to the lead, that birdie. Solid par four here. The 15th is 468 yards. Oh, yeah. Cool. Oh. Gave that the full treatment. Get up. Yeah, fire. Huge with a capital H. Moved it a long ways. That, Frank, is position A. Wouldn't you like to have that in your bag every day? Love it. is right at it. Frank, very solid shot there. Yeah, 12 footer coming up. You don't want to let this one get away. This is about concentration and focus at this point. Oh, just a lip right. out's fine as long as it doesn't happen to you. Clean this up with a tap. Did the job right there. Par 5 16th is a slight dog leg left at 600 yards. All right, this pull again. That would be super fun hole to drive. Oh, look at that. Always makes the hole easier playing it from the fairway. Second shot. Oh. 
Paying attention like a little kid at school, Frank. That baby's sitting up. Sitting up? It's got the best view as well. You don't even need binoculars from where that ball is. Oh, that's a Oh, nice strike, Rich. Not quite directly in line oh, no. with the flag. Just oh, no. a bit to the right, Ooh, but he'll settle. Frank, not where he right, wants to be, five. but not out of the hole here at the par Look five. No, nice. but uh, Rich, to drop a shot here would uh, would really set him backwards. Coming out of the rough and right up next to the hole. Not a gimme, but well within his range. That's costly right there. Painful. Not the best stuff we've seen today, that's for sure. Yeah, bogeys aren't gonna cut it, especially when we should be making a move in the other direction. Well, 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 here we are at the famous Alcatraz. Look at this thing. Wind's pushing in the uh... This one doesn't look good. His water oh, no, on you took, took too much off. Oh. Frank, there's fairway, there's rough, and then there's mulch. Yeah, the, the worst thing about the mulch is all these little chips around the ball and that, so the ball doesn't sit up. And uh... Well, this is always one of the toughest moments oh, in any good. round. You've made a mistake, you hit it OB, you're disappointed, but you have to yeah, regroup, you, you have to focus, much. and try to get this next one in play. So playing the third shot right now after having gone OB. Should be safely on deck. That was well done, and now a very short putt to get out of here with a bogey. Well, it could be a lot worse, that's for sure. Five minutes ago. Well, too bad he gives one back. Okay, let's get a run back here. That's not good. Well, Frank, hopefully the player has arrived here at 18 in a pretty good frame of mind. If not, you have to be thinking, oh, here we go again. Water left. I mean, you, you could shoot 100 out here on this golf course if you don't have your best stuff. Yeah, this is a, another example of, um, you, you're right, if you've got the bad mojo going, this is not the hole you want to be playing. Water left, bunkers right. Um, somewhere in between, though, this fairway. Flagstick from that man. Made a par in his previous round. This time, it's for birdie. Inside firm putt. Oh. Frank, all of a sudden, another player to factor in on this leaderboard. Yeah, and things are starting to tighten up right now. Going to see where the next move comes from. Conveniently four strokes up the lead. That's the computer saying to me, I have to make birdies on every hole to win this thing. EA Sports is proud to present today's PGA Tour coverage. 
Today it's live third round coverage of the Career Builder Challenge. Well, the architect Pete Dye is known for visual intimidation. We see it at TPC Sawgrass at the players every year. And you see it right here, Frank, at this 255-yard par 3-6 with water everywhere you look. Yeah, you could make an argument here that it suits a little bit of a cut, like a Lee Trevino-style fade that starts at the left and moves its way to the green. But then that's also moving back towards the water. Conversely, if you try and fly it over that water on the right side with a little bit of a draw, then the green starts to run out on the left side. Have I made it sound hard? Frank, he's knocking him down and forward, my him up. Oh, oh just hard. taking pins out one after the other. Settles in over the putt. Oh, so frustrating burner. sometimes on the greens, isn't it? Drop shot it. here at the sixth. Young. Just a little tap in here. And you better put it. And that's a bogey. Dropping back. We're at the seventh now, 346 yards with plenty of water on that right side. How do you handle this one, Frank? You've got to pick a target there. A lot of people think when they're laying up off the tee, and that's exactly what this hole is, you just blaze away at something down the left side. But if you're going to pick a tree, just pick the tree. Pick a branch or a leaf. Be more specific. Frank couldn't ask for anything more. Uh, just the lie there, too. It is sitting up like it's teed up. Well, Frank, no doubt players thinking about one thing, making a three, hitting a good shot in there close. Yeah, the green does narrow up a little bit in that back left corner, but a good lap gives you a chance to go directly at the flag. Seems to like it. Looks like it's headed for the green. Uh, wow, yeah. Frank, he is dialed in. Again. Yeah, that was just some shot on there. Easy birdie. Just a couple of feet. Uh, right side, firm putts. Needs a few more of those. That was a good birdie. Yeah, this time, that one gets him in the top 10. 555 yard, par 5, eighth hole. Frank, is this a two shotter or a three shotter? Uh, good question, Rich. It starts to shrink down by the walkway, which oh, is around that 30 yard mark. Uh, that's the decision has to be made. Personally, I think you try it at first, because even if you do find a fairway bunker, then it is certainly a layup. If you've got the distance, uh, it's well worth the risk. Now from a good position in the fairway, his second shot. He makes a great pass at the golf ball. It's powerful, but it's rhythmic at the same time. Now the approach shot here on this par 5 eight. Frank, is this one going to be okay? Yeah, just a little right. Seemed like good contact. Birdie try up next. Now this for Birdie came away with par in the previous round. Second least pick up a shot. Of mine. All I had to do Birdie was looked like that. a sit up. Now, Pa. So, just a format. All right, walk away. Let's get the fuck out of here. A good effort 
a good par putt. Yeah, this guy. Frank, the par four ninth at 452 yards is all you want. Yeah, you could make five here every day just by poking it down the left side, but who wants to do that? Force your uh, hand, try and go down the right side. You might make the odd Give three. Give that make roll. A few more fours, but miss it on the right, and that's where you start to make a big number. Nothing to argue about there, right in the fairway. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah, really the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light special. This is going to be an interesting day. The wind is howling, or as they would say in Scotland, just a wee breeze. Good looking shot right here. Hold up, hold up, easy, easy. Certainly had enough power, just didn't have any touch. He'll need to be strong with this. Six inches. Nice approach shot. He'll be happy with that. You don't want to let this one get away. This is about concentration and focus at this point. Oh, I thought he had that. Well, he knew it right from the start. Just a poor putt. This to surrender. Only one shot. Oof, this is tough to watch. Um, I've already got my eyes covered. Three rounds in the books. Outside the top 10 going to the final 18. Frank, what are your thoughts? Well, I think you're going to have to approach the final round in a couple of different phases. Try and be aggressive early on. If you do get a few birdies in the bank, you really still can fancy yourself with a chance to win. It'll all depend on that start tomorrow. Mowing 3D grass. This is EA Sports. EGA Tour coverage coming up next. Today, it's the final round of the Career Builder Challenge. Tricky Make part three here, the 13th, 214 yards. Right, this hole again. Getting set for this next shot from the rough, what does the player need to be careful of here, Frank? Well, this is where we're going to see exactly how good they are because, you know, that's not exactly the best light, but it's sort of doable if you, if you know what you're doing. Makeable putt right here, currently sitting at one under for the round.
Look at this little, what is this telling me? There's no way this is gonna make this. Good work right there. We'll settle for par. Well, Frank, kind of a make or break hold here at the 14th, par four, 389 yards. Yeah, for the Cavalier player, you can sort of go at this. He goes oh, yeah. He here. Bang it out. Boom. Oh. Wow. John Daly, take a back seat, big fella. How about that drive? Is it stopped yet? It's still going. <laughs> Oh my goodness, Frank. Did you see Three, that? Yeah. He just annihilated that. He just threw precision out the window. This is all about brute strength, and that is miles. Nice strike, Rich. Not quite directly in line with the flag. Just drifting a bit to the right, but he'll settle. Standing over this putt, concentrating on the read. Him and stacking them right now. Six under par for the tournament. Sheamus is now at the 15. Par four, 468 yards. It is nicknamed Turning Home as we are making our way towards the close of this round. Just a good solid tee shot right there, about 280 yards. Frank, the 15th is called turning home. Time now to turn on the Jets and a good chance. Yeah, after a good drive, once again, height's going to be rewarded here with the second shot. See the way that green is protected by the bunkers. So if you can come in here really high, get that to land soft, there's a lot of flags on this green that you can go at. That's four feet above me. Oh, yeah. You can hear it right off the center of the club face. This has a chance to be close. That is an excellent play right there. The approach, giving him another good look. Shouldn't be a problem here. Firm putt. Right side, left side. A lip oh, out's come on. as long as it doesn't That's happen ridiculous. to you. Just to tap in to finish the hole. I'd be throwing my clubs in a real court. Good effort and good par putt. This is the second par five at PGA West of 600 or more yards. The 16th is a pretty good test. Second shot coming up here at the par five. Two hundred and forty-one yards. Good. Jeez. Ready for his third shot. Needs to hit this close. Uh, the 
this looks like it's going to find the target. See if you can get this one to drop here at the 16th for a birdie. Par yesterday. Now for birdie. It's a good-looking putt, just not falling right now. No, sadly, he's going to be disappointed. And getting ready for the putt. For a right side. He's made it. Just in real life. Putt. Well, we've arrived. Alcatraz, the signature hole here at PGA West. Well, that's how you play the game right there. Knock it on the green and give yourself a good look at birdie. This is a 16-footer. Get in there. Yeah. Big part. Right, that birdie will help the cause. Run. One great hole after another here at PGA West. The finishing hole, no exception. Frank, what can we expect here? Great finishing hole. Uh, it's amazing. If you took the three bunkers uh, we're first going to see down the right side, this would almost be a nothing hole. Because they're perfectly situated here, they really shrink up that driving area down the left side. And this is just a reward for uh, a great swing, a great strike, a great shot. From the fairway, 135 yards away. That's a good shot right there, about 15 feet away. Good look at Birdie. It's a little snack, though. when you think you're oh, going to make birdie. Nuts. Now, have to really concentrate on this and at least make par. Yeah, that's a good par there, Rich. What a thrilling day of golf. For Frank Navalo, I'm Rich Lerner. So long for now from the Career Builder Challenge at PGA West. Okay. Glad Ian Poulter didn't win. I don't like him. Pay me. Tied for fifth. Oh, I got to split that with three people. Seamus McSeamus.
There's gotta be a way to auto do this. No glasses? You don't do that anymore? Young and up and coming rookie, you gotta have a sponsor. 